If you want to beat back pain without pills, there's some new technology that may actually help you do that. Health anchor Liz Bonus joins us now to explain how it works. Liz. Hey guys, good afternoon once again. Tomorrow night at Mayfield Brain and Spine, there is a free program to help you learn more about beating back pain with this new technology. It is an informational session on something that uses what's called the Nevro, and it's used for what's called HF10 spinal cord stimulation therapy. We first told you about this new technology with the help of Anissa Long, who said it changed her life. Not that I'm a pro, but I'm able to play tennis. Wow. I celebrated being cleared for my activities with the new tennis racket, and I love it. Dr. Mark Orlando of Mayfield Brain and Spine was one of the first in the country to use the Nevro for what's called this HF10 therapy. It's sort of a next level spinal cord stimulator. The HF10 therapy calms the nerves to provide pain relief. A battery operated pulse generator is placed near the spinal cord to send mild electrical pulses to calm the nerves. This helps return them to a pain free state. It, it's a higher frequency of stimulation uh, that we believe acts in a different manner than the traditional tonic stimulation. Now you can call 513-569-5354 if you want to RSVP for that program. Again, it's tomorrow night, 6 to 8, Mayfield Brain and Spine now has a nice location in Norwood. Most of the time, if you qualify for this, it's covered by your medical insurance plan. Okay. And, you know, it's always better than being on long-term medications. Yeah. It sort of changes the signal, the pain signal, with the brain. And those have been around for a while, but this newer one, they say that um, the old ones used to sort of make you jump it, like you'd feel it, mm. you yeah. know? This one doesn't. It's supposed to be something that sort of becomes in your system and you don't know it's there except that the pain goes away. Is, is the treatment normally pills for back pain? It's well, not it's, an injection or it's something else? It's always whatever works for you, okay, but okay. I think we're now looking at any alternative possible yeah. because we didn't understand how addictive some of the medications were. Mm -hmm. You know, it started out, you just thought you take it for a month or two, mm -hmm. pain doesn't go away. Yeah. So now we're looking for long-term alternatives. This would be one that stays there and it could help you fix that for life. That'd be great. Need to know. All right. All right, tomorrow night. We'll be back at 5.30 talking to you about, I interviewed the doctor who was on court last night for the NKU basketball game where they won. Hey. They uh -huh. Yeah. All right. Keep it Thanks, Liz.